Hi, good evening. My name is Barrington Miller. I'm with the Canadian Securities Exchange. My friends call me Bear, and I'm here with Link. Link, tell me a little bit about your company. Thank you, Barrington. My name is uh, Lincoln Fish. I'm the CEO of Outco. Outco is a vertically integrated operation in San Diego, California. We distribute throughout the state of California. We have multiple brands uh, under our group, and that's our, our big play is we're focused on the science and the branding. It's all about product development and then using branding to create a kind of a defensible position in the market. We have the Ricky Williams brand and a brand called SD Cannabis, which is based on San Diego Customs motorcycle work. They're internationally known. Uh, we have a couple of really exciting brands coming out uh, this year as well. Can you tell us a little bit about your peers and uh, peer evaluations and why somebody would want to invest in Outco? Absolutely. Um, I think that a, a lot of what we're seeing in the market, at least in California right now, is uh, a lot of people are racing to be the biggest, the biggest cultivator, the biggest retailer and so forth. Our approach is very different uh, because we believe that at the end of the day, cannabis is going to be a consumer packaged goods play. And as a CPG play, we're not seeing a lot of either great science or great branding. We see some of each, but we've seen, I think we have the most comprehensive approach with both pieces. What are some short-term catalysts investors have to look forward to? Well, we have a number of product releases coming out uh, pretty soon that I think are going to be kind of groundbreaking, including one that uh, 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 called Buzzkill, which is a uh, CBD nasal spray that actually reduces a high uh, almost instantaneously. So that's a big that's a big product rolling out, and that's part of the reason we're moving toward going public on the exchange. We want to get investors on board before we make that move. Everyone's pretty excited uh, from our shareholder group. So speaking of uh, investing on the exchange or going public on our stock exchange, um, what's been your experience in dealing with the Canadian Securities Exchange? <laughs> I got to tell you, it's very different than what I expected. Uh, we came to Toronto not really knowing what what to think. You know, I've certainly had some uh, personal experience with Wall Street and whatnot. This was a very, very definitely a breath of fresh air. We came in, we were able to talk with some of the key people, really had a great uh, uh, discussion about what can happen. You popped in the room, that added a little bit. Uh, but no, it was a great uh, a great discussion. We're very excited about, you know, the fees are low, the, the but I think the number one thing is the enthusiasm is so high. And people see, I personally, CSE to me is the next NASDAQ. Well, thank you for that. And I'm gonna throw you a curveball question since you're not from here. Can you tell us what that is? The CN Tower? Perfect. <laughs> I'm Barrington Miller from the Canadian Securities Exchange. Thank you.